Welcome back to Asylum okay. Gaming. Asylum. Sure enough, it's a giant cookie wrapped in plastic. Sayori got hit in the face with the cookie. She glances, Sayori right. glances around. Alright. Is, is this a miracle? Is this a... It's, it's because I paid my restitution? <laughs> Retribution. Retribution. <laughs> Actually, that one that one almost worked. Fire is the cutest. All oh, right. my favorite. Ah. I was just gonna give it to you, but then I heard you blab about the cupcakes. It's totally worth seeing your reaction, though. <laughs> Natsuki, that's so nice of oh, you. I'm so happy. I'm so <laughs> Sayori hugs the cookie. <laughs> that was that cookie, dude. The cookie, <laughs> the cookie absorbs into her skin. <laughs> <laughs> Sayori transforms like, forms <laughs> into a freaking cookie. <laughs> so good. Jeez, just eat it. I did. Sayori rapidly tears open the wrapper and takes a huge bite. God, I wish I was that cookie. So good. <laughs> Sayori suddenly oh, claps yeah. her hands <laughs> over yeah. her breasts. Fuck I'm a bit more tongue. Fuck. God damn it. <laughs> You're going through a lot over just one cookie. She, she's obsessed. Natsuki takes a bite of her own cookie. Hey, yours looks really good too, Natsuki. Can I try it? Jeez. Jeez. No. Beggars can't be choosers. But yours is chocolate. Chocolate? She's gonna cry. Hey, you chocolate! You chocolate! Yeah, why do you think I gave you that one? Fine. Still, I'm really happy that you shared this one with me. <laughs> Sayori gets out of her seat and goes between behind <laughs> Natsuki really close and smells her hair, then wraps her arms around her. Oh jeez. Ah jeez. I get it, I get it. Cookie, alright. Cookie still in hand. Natsuki reaches up to nudge Sayori off of her. Oh. Sayori suddenly leans down oh, shit, dude. and takes a bite out of Natsuki's Cookie? Uh oh. Club gone sexual? Yeah, what is Frank this? Frank gone sexual, dude. Hey! Did you seriously just do that? Uh, <laughs> Mouthful. Sayori trots away to safety from the cops. Yuri and I laugh as well. She just jumped out the window yeah. and runs. Gee, she's such a kid sometimes. Monica, can you tell Sayori. Eh? Natsuki. Monica, Monica isn't, isn't in the club room. Ah, uh, where's Monica anyway? She's doing some research. Good question. Yes. Have any of you heard anything about her being late today? Not me. Where'd you come from? Yeah, I'm I back. haven't either. Hmm. hmm. That's a bit unusual. I hope. I hope she's okay. Of course she's okay. She's probably just had something to do today. She's pretty popular after Good all. Thing. Uh -huh. Her fang is very cute. You don't think she? She's a vampire. She has a. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. A dick. She's m probably more desirable <laughs> than all of us combined. That's sad. Oh. Uh, that's that's true. <laughs> they only Ex so I think all of them Excuse more desirable. Excuse me. Not to be that though. Suddenly she knows the she's door the Monica swings open. Sorry. Go my the side. Go my the side. Go and go in. All right, go on. Ah. Uh, there, there she is. There she is. There she is. I didn't mean to be late. I hope you guys weren't worried or anything. Eh? Monica chose the club over her boyfriend after all. You're so strong-willed. Bo boyfriend? What on earth are you talking about? I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> Monica <laughs> quizzically glances at me. Ah. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Never mind that. Aww. What held you up anyway? Uh, well, my last period today was study hall. To be honest, I kind of just lost track of time. Uh huh. <laughs> it makes no sense now. She's trying to. You would have something. heard the bell ring at least. I must not have heard it since I was practicing piano. Was it piano or study hall? Huh? Or was it sucking dick? <laughs> piano? <laughs> I wasn't aware you played music as well, Monica. Uh, I yeah, I, I don't played really. This, I played this. Game. <laughs> kind of just started recently. <laughs> I've, oh my god, I just feel like something. What? What What's skin flute meant? Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I've always wanted to learn piano. 
That's so cool. Yeah. You yeah, should play no. for us some. You should oh. play something for us, Monica. That's Monica looks. Mo Monica then played. <laughs> then played shooting star. Or that too. <laughs> All right. Maybe, maybe once I get a little better, I will. Hey. That sounds rad. I'd also look forward to it. Is that so? In that case, I won't let you down, Bath. Bust on a piano. <laughs> the rest one thing you're doing, though. My mic is fine, sweet. Ah. Uh, she always. I does. did it. Me? Any pressure or anything like right, that? <clears throat> <laughs> Don't worry. I've been practicing a whole lot recently, and I'd really love to ch the chance to share once I'm ready. I see. In that case, best of luck. Thanks. So I didn't miss anything, did I? Not, not really. I mean, I mean, I mean, I choose to leave out Sayori's mischievous yeah. escapade. Right. I'm sure Natsuki will end up complaining over anyway. Mm. Looks like everyone has already settled down. Sayori somehow already finished her entire cookie because she's obsessed with cookies. Yori is back to her book. Natsuki disappeared into the closet. She went back in that closet, dude. Man, she's trying to hide some. Well, she's a vampire, Man. so she just needs the oh, dark. Yeah. It looks like no one wants to be bothered today. He just sits there. I slumped down into the nearest desk. Nestor Yuri, how am I supposed to occupy myself with something literature related by myself like this? I guess I could always <laughs> read some of the book Yuri gave me, but I'm feeling a little tired, Reed. I could probably fall asleep right now. I close my eyes and end up listening in on Sayori's conversation with Monica. Monica. <clears throat> We're probably gonna seem really lame compared to all the other clubs. Yeah, though. yeah, we end up with uh, Sayori this this day. Uh huh. Well, we can't give up. The festival is our chance to show everyone what literature is all about. The problem is that the idea of a literature club sounds too dense and intellectual. Yeah, intellectual. They must be Rick and Morty fans. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> you must have really like, high IQ. Yeah, they must have an extremely like high IQ. You know. We just need a way of showing that to everyone. Big red. Something that makes something that speaks to their creative minds. What creative minds? Hmm. <laughs> that doesn't solve the problem, though. Eh? What do you mean? Even if we come up with the most fun thing ever, nobody will come in the first place if it's a literature event. So it's more important to figure out how to get people to show up in the first place, you know. And after they come, we can do the thing to speak to their creative minds. This. What's this? Sayori is taking this really seriously. It's rare to hear her deliberating like this. Ah, that's a good point. In that case, do you think food will do the trick? What kind? Oh, she's into it. Ah, well, I guess we could... Oh no. Cupcakes! <laughs> oh. Ah, good, good thinking. Natsuki would love to do that. Ah, you're right. Natsuki makes the best cupcakes. Fair enough. That should work out perfectly. That works out perfectly. That wasn't why you suggested it. Cupcakes speak to my creative Aww. tongue. What did you I want breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> cupcakes it is, then. I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> she just ignores her. Anyway, we still <laughs> need to work out the details of the event itself. Yeah. I find myself smiling. In the end, Sayori is still her usual self. <laughs> All right, but therein lies the unexpected reason I admire her. Oh shit! Unlike me, she loves breakfast. Who has? I hate breakfast. breakfast. I, know. I don't eat. Sayori can put her mind to things and make them come to life. I suppose that's why I end up letting her. That the thing is coming to life right now. Yeah, I can't help but wonder what it'd be like to see the world through her eyes. It's just all breakfast. Oh shit. <laughs> well there. That's her eyes. I open my eyes to find Sayori's face filling my vision. I nearly fall out of my seat. Eh, yeah, sorry. Wait. Actually, I'm not sorry at all. Oh. It's your fault for sleeping like that. This isn't a napping club. Is there a napping club? Does our school have a <laughs> napping club? I feel you, dude. You're staying up late again, aren't you? Yeah, he's just playing Xenoblade. Well, in Xenoblade Chronicles 2 for the Nintendo Switch. Nintendo? Switch. Are you playing Project Melee? <coughs> Oh, he's just mm -hmm. watching the anime, dude. I'm watching Total. Now that you're in a club, you're gonna have to. You're gonna have less time for anime, you know. He's just watching. You'll need movies. to get used to it. 
It's like don't fourteen thousand episodes in, into One Piece. I glance over my shoulder to see if Monica overheard. It's true though. Yeah, I know, I know. You're always looking out for me, Sayori. You have a crush on me? <laughs> it's what I do best. That's a problem. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> what about you? You look out for me better than you look out for yourself, you breakfast woman. You're still over sleeping every day, aren't you? Eh? N not every day. That's not very convincing. How many days this past week have you gotten up on time? That's... It's a secret! Oh, you freak. I knew it! Come on. At least give me the benefit of the doubt. I can't even do that. I can't even! I can't even! Look, Sori, it's written all over you. Eh? Just like my dick. Sayori glances around at herself. <laughs> Thank you. How is it written all over me? Thank you. You were clearly in a rush this morning. Look. Yeah. Your hair is sticking out all over here. Uh -huh. I run my fingertips <laughs> down the side of Sayori's hair. <laughs> she trying to straighten it. Oh, good. I want this guy. Man, you really need a brush for this. Very Dude. hands on with that. Makes sense. My hair is just really hard to get right. I will fall for that! It looks fine. There's more than just your hair. Oh shit. Look, your bow isn't straight either. And there's a toothpaste stain on your color, right? It sounds like me. I try to wipe off the stain with my <sighs> finger. But nobody would ever notice that. This poor girl. Of course they would! Nobody's gonna tell you about it because they don't want to embarrass you. Fortunately, <laughs> I really don't care about that. Hey, you meanie. And you don't even... Seriously, Sonobi. Why do you think you don't have a boyfriend? Oh god, oh, dang. So, oh, rude. Gee, you're such an asshole. Eh? That's super mean. I think he wants to be your boyfriend. Eh? Sorry. He'll think of me later. Wink, wink. Dude. I start to button her blazer from the bottom. Whoa, okay. Once you see how much better it looks, you'll change your mind. Like a girl changes clothes. Oh my clothes. god. This poor girl. Eh, eh. This is weird. Come on, Rappi. This is so oh, funny. <laughs> Well, what is? Well, I'm just thinking how weird it is to have a friend who does these kinds of things. Eh. Weird. Don't say that. You make me feel weird about it, stupid baka. It's okay though. I'm happy we're like this. Are you? Aren't you? Ah. Uh, I I guess. This is a weird. Hey, be careful. The bottom might come off. Ooh. The more but you look at this angle, the worse it is. Why is this one so hard to close? Like, look at the background. <laughs> I find <laughs> <laughs> this background. It's really disorientated. It struggle to finally close the button near her chest. Oh my god, then. Does this thing even fit you properly? <laughs> she wore something tighter. It did when I bought it. Sigh. If you ever bought it, you would have noticed sooner than it, it doesn't fit you anymore. What are you smiling about? It means uh, my boobs got bigger. Just again. like, just like Yuri. So don't <laughs> say that out loud. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, you look much better now. So at least she's happy. With uh, it. date me. <laughs> Why does it feel strange to see Sayori's blazer button up like this? It's so stuffy. It's not worth it at all. <clears throat> Sayori hastily unbuttons her she blazer just rips it open. once, like, once more. Yeah, we didn't want to draw a new character model for this. <laughs> Phew! It's true. So much better. Sayori so 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 breathe, dude. Puts her arms out and twirls around like a ballerina. So if I keep it unbuttoned, then I won't get a boyfriend, right? Uh, that's how that works. What kind of <laughs> logic is that? It's the logic you just said. Yeah. Why are you saying that like it's a good thing? Because if I had a boyfriend, then he wouldn't let me oh do God. things like this. Let uh, you do things like this. And you take better care of me than anyone anyone else would. Anyway, you might think it. Let's get. You might so think it's weird that she that's why I'm keeping person. it unbuttoned. Stop saying all these embarrassing things. Eh? I didn't say anything embarrassing. Jeez, us Christ. Well, anyway, just focus on trying to wake up a little earlier. Earlier. Why are you fucking going to bed earlier? Fine, fine, <laughs> Baka. It's a deal. <laughs> I guess we really are better at taking care of each other than we are at taking care of ourselves. Yeah, I guess so, huh? So maybe you should come wake me up in the morning. Wake me up in the morning! Wake, wake me, me up! It's a... You're doing it again, Sori. You're waking yourself up. In the morning. In the morning. Oh, but I was joking that time. 
Man, it's impossible to tell you some with you sometimes. Okay, everyone. And yeah. Monica suddenly calls out. Why don't we share our the phones we wrote now? Yay! Bethlin, I can't wait to read yours. Yeah. Yeah, same. I feel to sound enthusiastic, but Siori still trots away to retrieve her poem. Alright guys, next time on Next Ramble time on Gaming. Ramble Gaming. We're we'll gonna talk read some more, more poems, I <laughs> yes. guess. Alright, bye guys.